Hello, my name is Natalia Stapuk and this is a promo video for our paper Follow the Path Hierarchy Where Extreme Multi-Label Completion for Semantic Text Tagging. In our paper, we address the problem of extreme multi-label classification, which is the task of assigning multiple labels to instances where labels come from an extremely large label collection. In particular, we are interested in label completion subtask when the task is to predict missing labels for instances which are already partially labeled. One important application of uh, multi-label classification is semantic text tagging. This is the task we aim to solve in uh, our paper. We proceed in our work from an important assumption that labels which are used for tagging a document are organized hierarchically. For example, they can be structured in taxonomy or into ontology. Our approach is based on two intuitions. First is that uh, relevant labels assigned to a document are usually represented by some specific tokens inside this document. And the second intuition is that relevant labels assigned to the same document are often correlated and they should be treated jointly. These two ideas can be naturally implemented in the full transformer architecture. If we uh, consider document as an input sequence and labels as an output sequence, then encoder-decoder cross-attention will capture the dependencies between document tokens and labels, and decoder self-attention will learn the label correlation. And the only problem is how to reformulate multi-label classification as a sequence-to-sequence -sequence task. So we have sequence is an input, this is the document, but the question is how to represent labels as a sequence. And to do this, we are leveraging our taxonomy, our uh, hierarchy of labels, and we convert the unordered set of labels into the set of paths in the taxonomy. And paths are actually represent sequences, so they can be used as output sequence in our sequence-to-sequence -sequence model. For more details and for experimental results, please refer to our full paper. Thank you.